Well hello, this is Rochelle and welcome to my channel. Today I'm unboxing a few goodies, amongst which is this free printable from Creative Retreat. You can download this from their online store. You do have to go through the checkout process, but uh, after that it's just uh, download and print to enjoy all of these wonderful goodies. A two-page free printable from Creative Retreat. This month sees another uh, add-on to or an additional uh, devotional kit that you can also purchase from their online store um, and this is under the faith filled digitals i love the pattern paper i love the little ephemera or pieces that you can cut out in the front as well as the extra devotional content it's just always uh, a joy to work with their products so a four page printable from their faithful digitals on their online store that's creative retreat next up is ella roots and as always uh super cute and this month is all fruity i took the alpha bait that she's selling on her etsy store and printed it on the pattern paper that comes with that printable uh, like we said, all fruity, so the girls in watermelons, <laughs> it's so cute. And then olives uh, here, speaking of holy, uh, of God's name being holy. And so I took the names of God, uh, free printable that she's also offering, printed it on the pattern paper that goes with that olive printable. And that is another way to use it. This is a black and white that you can also print on its pattern paper for a different kind of a prayer card. Uh, if you printed it directly on there so that is also an option i love all the pattern paper in this uh, range or this month's releases it's just really pretty and can be used for so many things these gorgeous trees and then their cloudy pattern paper that goes with that and then some fruity planner love to go with all of the good planner um, and fruity stuff this month <laughs> Next up from Scribbles on My Heart is a devotional called I Love Jesus or a set called I Love Jesus and it is in a traveler's notebook format cover and then you can print as many of the inners as you want. Uh, I print them back to back so that I have the lined um, ready for my notebook so that I can do all of the note keeping of this I Heart Jesus devotional that is over here so this is the mini art and decorative pieces that uh, goes with this devotional it has some scripture references that you can go through on your own time and that's that next up i do want to use one of the printables uh, by ella roots for a quick process video to show you that it really doesn't have to take long or be extremely difficult it just has to be time in the word you know that that's what this is all about it's not about the art it really is about time in the word i took three shades of green gelatos and scribbled them down onto my non-stick craft surface um, i'm using a caran d'ache textured palette which i quite enjoy using with gelatos because it uh, just picks up all of the pigment so beautifully and i'm blending it onto the page or the negative image onto the page using a foundation contour makeup brush and i'm just taking the three different kind of gelatos and um, that just gives it some depth and some extra uh, texture with the color not being flat or just one colored and using different sizes of the leaves to just do that negative image um, i just wanted to have that uh, different element and texture to it I am using the leaves as reference for the veins that are on them so I'm picking up the pigment that's left over on my palette with a wet um, water watercolor brush or water brush and uh, just drawing in the veins very loosely not perfectly because most of this is going to be covered anyways it is in the end all about spending the time in the word um, concentrating on what it is that you're reading and for today's word on this principle it is all about remaining in God God saying Jesus saying that if we remain in him he remains in us and we are connected and it's because of that connection because of our 
getting our food from the source that we are sustained and that we bear fruit and that we remain so it continues it's not something that withers off and dies because we are connected to the source who is the father so jesus says we should abide in him um, and he will abide in us remain in us and in that way we will bear fruit um, but then he says he warns that if we don't and we don't bear fruit um, it is something that then will cause the branch to be cut off so not a threat just really a <laughs> a gentleman way of saying i give you choices you know life and death you choose but i want to like say and give you a little hint choose life <laughs> so um, as always god is such a gentleman and he uh, gives us the choice in the end but gives us a hint to choose the right choice so i'm using that alpha that scripty or scribbly alpha that i printed onto the pattern paper and i'm just sticking them down i cut it in three different sizes remain in him um, and then i'm taking some of the actual leaves that i just used that now have that added texture to it from the gelatos and i'm just putting it down um, two little places and then taking my white gel pen now remember a gel pen if you want it to work it needs to be a size 10. Um, this jelly roll size 10 is definitely uh, a good one to work with and it's nice and juicy it does go through it pretty quickly because it is so juicy but um, there you go just drawing in some extra veins and some highlights on the letters of this remain in him which is in john 15 verse 4 and 5 um, beautiful scripture I love that and then as you can see it has all the kind of lovely texture of the uh, stenciled leaves as well as the actual uh, glued on leaves and it has all of that extra texture with you having uh, written on it and let's just add some splatters for good measure but first let's uh, date stamp it remember to always date stamp your work it just helps you to when you go through your journey see where you've been and what you've accomplished taking that black ink and splattering it and uh, there we go that's the page quick and easy using the Ella Root releases of the 15th of March I do want to share a little bit of extra with you uh, this month it is from a company called gel press press and these are their uh, gel press plates um, and it's the faith impressions version of it and it's really uh, just super cute lots of different options that you can have with that um, this is a kind of leaf pattern and what I really like about these gel press impressibles is that it's 12 by 12 so you can actually do a, a full-size scrapbook paper with it and uh, use that then as different projects it doesn't have to just be Bible journaling but specifically um, they do now have a Bible journaling set, which the gel press plate is then big enough um, to fit in the margin of either the big illustrated faith Bible or um, or illustrating faith Bible, etc., etc. So these gel accessories are also super cute, and um, they are different texture combs and a brayer and just. Uh, lots and lots of goodies that is available from a company called gel press in the United States I'm super impressed with their delivery it took two weeks from order to get it here I'm just really it's that's a plus now as you see this has a faith impressions little booklet in it I'm going to take this booklet out in a second and you'll see the kind of gel plates on the sides of this still um, visible uh, and this then is created by or with uh, Carrie Sally and I hope I'm saying that right and it has a short introduction to Bible journaling it has a why the what the how um, and then she does a seven day gel press Bible journaling kind of journey in this booklet and you'll see there's day one with a blank page where you can then add your art or go straight to the Bible um, but this looks like a very valuable little booklet 
to then dive into if you order your gel press. Um, all of the info on there and I will link it down below. Thanks for joining me. Hope to see you again soon. Bye-bye.